The other two. <laughs> um, I needed the one, two, and three for something else, so I, I just put that together. Locomotive air horn collectors from around the country gather here once a year and with a chance to put their horns on an actual operating locomotive and hear them as they should sound in service. I think you all know the premise. We do the run bys, we'll back the engine down out of sight, come by with the horn blowing with the 14L standard grade crossing. Uh, they'll blow around the curve and go uh, maybe a couple hundred yards back up and then we'll change the horns. Many collectors own horns, but don't have a way to blow them other than a portable air tank or air compressor or something like that. So this is a chance to really hear them as they were meant to be heard. My name is Jeffrey Sessa, and I'm from Gaithersburg, Maryland. Western Pacific Chrome and Green. Right. So I'm guessing you're not touching that one, at least not the paint. No. My collection started when I was 15. Uh, I'm up to 27 horns now, I believe. Western Maryland S15. Nice. And it started out where there was specific kinds of horns that I wanted, ones that I had maybe a connection or a memory to but kind of like anything else, you get one and you want more. 